Uh, in this lesson, we will cover the uh, Power Apps Model Driven App uh, subgrids. So first, we go to Solution and we create a new solution. Solution related related file. We select the publisher. We say create. Then inside this, we create a new table. TBL user 6 primary key user ID add column first name done add column last name done save the table then in the forms we'll wait for the table 6 to be refreshed forms views we still need to wait for the data once the views are loaded we'll take the active view and we'll add first name last name to it we save we publish back we'll wait we click on we click on forms we click on the main form edit form we click component first we will add the form field last name last name and done save publish while it's publishing under dataverse tables we'll create a new table tbl user sales 5 we'll give the name 6 and the primary key user sales id
sales ID then create add column user ID we call it we make it lookup and the table is user tbl user 6 the user id is yeah done then we add column product product done we add column amount then save table then under the forms main edit form edit form under general let's add the fields amount product user id and under components we can put subgrid and under subgrid we'll pick the so you can see the user right there done save publish now when we see data add record I need to refresh it's published we publish both of them this is done this is also done we come here under table user sales 6 refresh data add record Among thousand product cosmetics user ID new user save and continue user ID is seven, 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 seven. Uh, shake save and close now we see our user id here now we can pick the user id cell so we will see the details of the user id right here so uh, save and close okay uh, refresh data i click this guy i say edit record so ignore the error just need to refresh but we will see the user sales and the uh, details of that you know when you uh, when you add the record you will see the user information right there so you can see which user to pick while adding that's it